Hey, what's up you guys? I'm Aaron with U-Haul. The Yakima Full Swing is a great bike rack option for you and your family. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at its features. All right, so the Yakima Full Swing is a four bike rack. Each position can hold the bike up to 40 pounds with a total weight capacity of 150 pounds. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the shank. This is a two inch shank, and it comes with a anti-wobble device, so it'll help tighten and keep it secure inside of the receiver. And then on the end, it has an automatic lock for the receiver to help keep it in place. All right, now that we've highlighted these features, let's go ahead and show you how to put it on a car. Right, installing this bike rack on your vehicle is super easy. The shank only fits a two inch receiver, but you'll just line it up and you'll push it in until the automatic pin lock clicks into place. Once it's clicked into place, as you can see, there's a lot of play with it. So that's where the red knob comes into place. This is your anti-wobble. You'll just go ahead and turn it until it's nice and tight and you've eliminated all the play. And so no one takes off with your rack. It comes with a key that you can secure that knob so it'll spin freely and no one will be able to remove it from your vehicle. All right guys, let's go ahead and take a look at the main feature for this bike rack and that is the swing feature. Right behind the mast right here, we have a long knob. If we turn that counterclockwise, it will release. And then pulling up on this gray knob right here, it will allow the bike rack to swing out of the way. And as you can see, it gives you complete access to your cargo area. So you can go ahead and open up your hatch, your trunk, lower your tailgate, depending on what your vehicle is. And to bring the mast back into place, you'll just push down on this red knob in the center, and that will allow it to swing back. And once you get towards the end, we'll pull up on this gray knob again, and that will allow the mast to swivel and click back into place. And then we'll tighten our longer knob again, just by turning it clockwise, until it secures the rack into place. All right guys, let's go ahead and prep our bike rack to put a bike into place. To pull the arms up, you're just gonna pull on this gray lever right here and pull it up till it clicks into place. Now both arms are coated in a protective rubber, which will prevent scratching on your bike frame. And this rack will fit most traditional bike frames as long as it has a straight top tube. If you don't, you will need to get an adapter for your bike to fit. Now for each of the cradles, it is adjustable for your bike depending on the width that you need. You just pull down on this gray tab right here and it will allow the cradle to move freely. And then you just push it back to lock it into place. Now when putting your bike on, Yakima includes zip strips to secure your frame to the rack. You just push down on these two tabs right here and it will allow you to release it. To secure each bike, the front will just include one for the top tube and for the opposite side, for the rear of your bike, it will come with one zip strip for the top tube and one for the seat tube. So let's go ahead and remove the zip strips for the forwardmost cradles and show you how to put a bike on. Loading a bike on this rack is really easy. You'll just take the bike and load it up, heaviest bike towards the front, and you'll just line it up with the cradles secure the front part of the top tube with the zip strip and towards the seat we're going to go ahead and secure the top tube and then we'll push the bottom cradle out and secure the seat tube with the last zip strip and on the front wheel to help prevent if from swinging around freely, Yakima does include a tie down to help secure it to the frame.
and it does come long enough where you can secure all four of the tires. And to prevent the theft of your bikes, the Yakima does a great job by including a locking cable, which you would just pull over your bikes. And there's a hole right here on the passenger side arm that will lock into place and no one would be able to remove your bike from the rack. All right, now that we have one bike loaded on the bike rack, let's go ahead and show how easy it is to open. As you can see, it swings out, and even with the bike on, we still have access to our cargo area, so you can still open your hatchback or lower your tailgate depending on your vehicle. And to bring it back, we'll just push down on that red button right there, and we'll swing this back into place. All right guys, once again, that's the Yakima full swing. Whether you're heading downtown, hitting some trails, or just going on a trip with your bikes, the Yakima full swing is perfect for you and your family. You can find it on uhaul.com or at your closest U-Haul center. Thank you for joining us today.